In the annals of television history, the 1976 series Family stands as a time-honored emblem of the industry's prowess. What enduring qualities have solidified its status as a lasting symbol, weaving its narrative into the fabric of television culture? As we delve into the lesser-known facets of this iconic show, we invite you to ponder the subtle details that add layers to its legacy. Did you know that behind the scenes, the creators faced unforeseen challenges, or perhaps there are anecdotes that have eluded the spotlight? Unraveling the hidden stories behind the production can deepen our appreciation for the resilience that birthed this enduring series. As you reflect on family, what cherished memory or personal experience holds a special place in your heart? We'd love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Your unique perspectives contribute to the rich tapestry of shared experiences surrounding this timeless television gem. Now, let's embark on a journey through the captivating facts that shaped family, shedding light on the intricacies that make it more than just a series, but a cultural touchstone. In 1976, the TV series Family boasted a remarkable cast, including three Oscar winners Helen Hunt, Tommy Lee Jones, and Henry Fonda. Additionally, Quinn Cummings, an Oscar nominee, joined the talented ensemble. The show featured multiple Emmy winners and nominees, with Christy McNichol, Gary Frank, and Sada Thompson earning Emmy Awards for their performances. James Broderick and Meredith Baxter received Emmy nominations, showcasing the caliber of talent associated with the series. A noteworthy aspect of family lies in the casting changes for the character Nancy. Originally played by Elaine Heilvale, she declined to continue after the miniseries transitioned into a regular series. Jane Ackman briefly stepped into the role but was unexpectedly replaced by ABC chief Fred Silverman, who actively pursued Meredith Baxter. Despite initial reservations due to her family commitments, Baxter's portrayal of Nancy Lawrence became a standout earning her two Emmy nominations for Outstanding Supporting Actress. Interestingly, Cheryl Ladd, who auditioned for the role of Nancy, faced rejection but found her way to another iconic show, Charlie's Angels, a year later. The dynamics of casting choices and the subsequent impact on the show's narrative and character portrayal offer a compelling angle to explore the behind-the-scenes developments of family. This brief overview highlights the star-studded cast, Emmy recognitions, and the intriguing casting evolution of family, shedding light on the intricate web of decisions that shaped the series. Delving into these aspects provides a richer understanding of the show's dynamics and the talent that contributed to its success. In 1988, plans for a reunion movie of the 1976 TV series Family were underway. Meredith Baxter Burney, riding high on her success from Family Ties, played a pivotal role. Insisting on multiple rewrites, she eventually rejected the idea altogether. This decision led to the cancellation of the entire project by producers Aaron Spelling, Pressman, and company. The behind-the-scenes dynamics of this reunion attempt, influenced by Baxter's influence and subsequent refusal, shed light on the complexities of bringing the family cast back together. Interestingly, when planning the reunion, only Baxter was consulted, despite the fact that there were three actresses who portrayed the character Nancy over the series run Elaine Heilvale, Jane Actman, and Meredith Baxter. This omission raises questions about the decision-making process and the potential insights the other two Nancys could have offered. The failed 1988 reunion project, marked by rewrites and Baxter's rejection, remains a notable chapter in the post-1976 family narrative. The ripple effect of these decisions adds layers to our understanding of the show's legacy. Additionally, it's worth noting that cast members, including James Broderick, Meredith Baxter Burney, Gary Frank, Quinn Cummings, and John Rubenstein, participated in the Family Feud Celebrity 2 edition, raising over $15,000 for cystic fibrosis. This charitable event showcases another dimension of the family cast's camaraderie beyond the screen, contributing to the series' broader impact. In a lesser-known episode titled Lifeline of the 1976 TV series Family, Quinn Cummings made her debut as Marcy, a local girl often seen accompanying Buddy. This brief appearance marked the beginning of Cummings' involvement with the show, setting the stage for her later contributions to the ensemble cast. As Family progressed, Quinn Cummings would become a more prominent figure, eventually earning an Oscar nomination, further solidifying the diverse talent within the series. 
Interestingly, the intricate dynamics of the jury duty episode added a layer of depth to family's narrative. Drawing parallels with an episode from All in the Family, where Edith holds out on convicting a Hispanic defendant, the family episode unfolds similarly. Hate's decision to withhold her conviction for Rudy Courts, mirroring Edith's stance, not only showcases the series' thematic richness, but also highlights the nuanced exploration of societal issues during the show's run. Beyond the on-screen talent, the Family series served as a launchpad for several actors who would later find success in Aaron Spelling's productions. Notable names like Helen Hunt, Jenny O'Hara, Dana Plato, and Lisa Welchel all had their beginnings in Family before making their mark on the popular show Facts of Life. This connection further underscores the significance of Family as a breeding ground for talent in the television industry. These lesser explored facets of the 1976 TV series Family contribute to a more comprehensive understanding of its impact on the entertainment landscape. From the early appearances of Quinn Cummings to the thought-provoking parallels in the Jury Duty episode, and the significant role it played in shaping the careers of future stars, Family proves to be a show with layers worth uncovering. In 1988, plans for a reunion movie of the series were in motion, with the entire cast on board, except for the late James Broderick. The project, however, faced a setback due to a writer's strike, leading to its eventual cancellation. The cast's unanimous agreement and subsequent challenges in bringing the reunion to fruition offer a lens into the complexities behind the scenes. The impact of external factors like the writer's strike on the reunion project adds a layer to the narrative of the series' post-1976 journey. This failed attempt at reuniting the family cast serves as a noteworthy chapter, showcasing the hurdles faced in extending the legacy of the beloved show. In 1976, Meredith Baxter Burney, part of the family cast, also took on a small role in the acclaimed political thriller All the President's Men. Despite her success in the TV series, she showcased her versatility in this notable film. The same year, Linda Palmer, credited as Linda Weintraub for specific family episodes, adopted the name due to her marital status. This behind-the-scenes detail adds a layer of complexity to the production process. Interestingly, both Christy McNichol and Meredith Baxter, who portrayed the Lawrence daughters, later came out as lesbian each revealing this aspect of their lives around 30 years after the show's original run. These personal journeys, though unrelated to the series itself, offer insights into the diverse experiences of the family cast members beyond the screen. In 1988, plans for a reunion movie with the entire cast, excluding the late James Broderick, faced a setback due to a writer's strike, leading to its eventual cancellation. This failed attempt at reuniting the family cast serves as a noteworthy chapter, showcasing the hurdles faced in extending the legacy of the beloved show. The impact of external factors like the writer's strike on the reunion project adds a layer to the narrative of the series' post-1976 journey. Expanding our understanding of the family cast's individual endeavors, including Meredith Baxter's venture into all the president's men, reveals the multifaceted nature of the actors' careers. These behind-the-scenes glimpses contribute to a richer perspective on the enduring impact of the 1976 TV series Family. As we bid adieu to the captivating world of the 1976 TV series, family, let's take a moment to reflect on the intricate threads that wove our emotions into the fabric of this timeless narrative. Like a cherished family album, the show preserves moments of laughter, tears, and the indelible marks left by characters who became part of our lives. As the credits roll, I encourage you to journey into the recesses of your memories, dusting off the cobwebs to unveil the treasures of your personal connection with family. Whether it's the resonance of poignant dialogues, the warmth of shared laughter, or the echoes of life lessons learned, each viewer's experience is a unique tapestry, intricately woven with the show's episodes. In this digital space, let's create a virtual hearth where you can share your favorite anecdotes, the scenes that linger in your mind, or the characters who feel like old friends. How did family become a part of your own narrative? 
What reflections does it conjure in the theater of your mind? Your stories are the hidden gems that enrich the collective appreciation for this iconic series. So, dear viewer, as you embark on this introspective journey, remember that the beauty of family lies not only in the episodes that unfolded on screen, but in the myriad ways it mirrored our own lives. Share your thoughts, and let the discussion become a celebration of the shared tapestry we've all contributed to. Thank you for joining us in this exploration of nostalgia and connection. Your time and interest have made this journey even more meaningful. Until we meet again in the realms of reminiscence, keep the spirit of family alive in your heart.